With cameras so readily available, it's easy to accumulate more photos than you know what to do with. If your photos look chaotic, we'll help you organize them with these simple tips. If you enjoy our videos, give us a thumbs up and subscribe so you never miss out on more helpful tips. The Photos app on your Mac makes it easy to organize your pictures. To import all your photos here, just connect your iPhone or iPad to your Mac. In the Photos app on your Mac, choose your iPhone under Devices in the sidebar and click Import All New Photos. Alternatively, you can enable iCloud Photos in the settings to keep your photos and videos up to date and available on all of your Apple devices. As you now have all your photos on your Mac, you can see what you can declutter. You can do that manually or get the Clean My Mac app to save time. It identifies and removes duplicate files, freeing up storage space for what truly matters. Try it free for seven days. Check out the link in the description. Albums are perfect for regrouping photos by events, vacations, or themes. To create a new album, choose File, New Album. Want to go further? Try Smart Albums, which automatically organize photos based on criteria like dates, locations, or keywords. Go to File and click New Smart Album. Set your rules like grouping all photos taken on a specific date or images with a certain person in them. Make your best shots easier to find. Mark important photos as favorites by clicking the little heart icon. If you are unhappy with the automatic face selection, you can tag people manually. Click View, Show Face Names. Double click a photo and open it. Click the eye icon and click Add Faces. Move the circle to the needed position and adjust its size. Enter the name and press Return. You can now find this photo under People in the sidebar. In addition to adding names, you can also include location information for your photos. To view and edit the location info, double-click the photo and then click the eye icon. Click Assign a Location and enter the relevant details. Once the location is added, go to Places to see your photos displayed on the map. Do you have too many similar shots or duplicates cluttering your library? Watch this video to learn how to free up space and keep your photo library tidy. And that's it. Your photo library is now neat, organized, and easy to navigate. Thanks for watching and see you next time.